welcome to quick learning in today's session we will learn another exciting transaction of SAP that is very much helpful in our inventory management especially and in material management module as well this is MB03 transaction MB03 transaction is used to display the details of any material document so this transaction is simply used to get all the details inside a particular material document so we will start by writing MB03 in our transaction tab we will press enter and you will see that this will be displayed in, in on your main screen only two items only two tabs one is the material document and other is the material document year so for the first number if we know the material document number for which we want to get all the details we will just write our material document number here and we will enter its year in which year their document is created we will press enter and uh, then you know the all the details will be displayed there for example I know a certain uh, material document number and I know its material document year I have written both these things over there I will just press enter and now you will see that this material document is now visible in front of me so it shows that this material document contains though I two line items the first one is 900205 material code this it is quantity is 1600 PHC is its unit its plant is 1111 and storage location is 1106 material move the movement type for that document is 303 the person who created this document is this one and the posting date of that document is 31st January uh, July 2020 so you can see that by just entering uh, the material document number I am able to get all the details of that particular material document number okay so going back this is a case it's a very simple transaction to use but this is the case when we know uh, a particular material document number in case I do not know the exact material document number so what will you do what will I do in that case so for that what I will do is I will go to this press this button that is the two square windows I will click it and now another window will open in front of you so basically this window will enable us to find the required material document number as per our required data so what does this window show us this window is similar to the transaction MB 51 when you uh, uh, use MB 51 the similar window appears in front of you so what it what th does this window has it has material number the range you can just enter one material number or a range of numbers the plant or range of plants storage locations batch vendor movement type special stock post posting date username etc so we can find a required material document number from this window for example I want there is an other interesting case if I do not know what is my material code for which I want to uh, find the material document number but I know the sum of the description of that material code then what I will do I will again go to this multiple selection tab so that I can select more than one option I will go there in the search tab of material description because I have some idea about uh, the description of that material I will write ozone for example this is the material description that I know and I want to find the material document that is related to this particular material code so you can see a long list will appear in front of you 
and it will have a multiple codes available and you can find your relevant required ones and but I will search this uh, table and I would know that this below these two document numbers are my requirement aquamatch ozj this is the part number that i was looking for this one and then this one is ozy dcfs1 okay i will press click button and these two things will appear here you can see these material codes have appeared now so what i what i have done to summarize again i wanted to get I, I, I had the idea of the material description. I know it is OZYJ781 for example and I wanted to find the material document number for this particular material description code. But I didn't know the material code so I came to MB03. I entered it. I pressed that button to go into the detailed menu in that in material code tab I again go to multiple selection and I search that particular material uh, code using ozone by writing ozone then then a long list appeared in front of me then i then i selected these two from them so i will i copy them these two will appear here and i will enter my plant as well for example this is the plant and uh, to make things more simple i can you know just uh, enter a range of date for example I wanted to get detail in year complete year 2020 so I will write 2020 year so you can see I have found material document uh, number material codes the plant and the date okay so this is then I will press execute and now it will show me all the material documents for these material codes in that but in that period of time so you can see here this window has appeared in front of you so it is showing that we have for we have the details for only one material code so the there was the, no document exists for the other material code that i selected so for, details are available for this single material code only and what what is in it we have these six material documents over there that have been posted for this material code and these are in different movement types 261 262 issuances from spare part store its reversals its purchase orders its movements etc so i can get now in 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 these document numbers what i will do i will select any one of these to get the details inside that material document number so my intent was to get the details inside a particular material document number i will press double click on this one and you can will see this material document number has appeared here what i will do i will write the year i know it's 2020 then i will press execute and now you will see what is inside that material uh, document number so this material document number was created in 29th of April 2020. This was the delivery note. No, this was the person. It seems that it was a uh, purchase order delivery number like the GR goods receipt number. The quantity was one. This is the material description the code. This is the description. This was the plan. This was the location and this was the batch. I further clicked it and you can see this these are the details of that purchase order this was that purchase order particular this was the document number on which from which it is posted this is plant this was the code of the vendor this is the vendor name this is the material code again unit of entries one and all that so you you have seen that in this the, from this simple transaction MB03 I am able to get the details of my material document, any material document number, but I can also get the details of all the material document numbers by just going to this particular screen and now it will allow me to search out any material document number based upon its material code or plant or batch or storage location or vendor etc. 
so you have seen this is a very useful transaction code mb03 i hope that this session would have been very uh, useful for all of you for any question you can just write in comments tab please like and share th this video please subscribe to our channel until next time bye bye